This music is so fucking awesome. Da, 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 da. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. I welcome you to part two. Of oh, I almost said the red attack, but no, it's Fire Emblem Three. Um, the reason why the uh, last episode got cut short was because my computer kind of died in the middle of the recording. Um, so I had to kind of restart the chapter since. Um, I didn't make a save state, however, I've just moved up until this point. Um, it was roughly here we cut off anyway, we're about to take on the pass, and I just remember how awful the map design in Fire Emblem 3 can be sometimes. There's a fucking mountain in the choke points. What does this mean? Well, firstly, every single cavalier that I have must dismount in order to go over the mountains. The archers can't go over the mountains at all, neither can Doga, and I also have my doubts that Melissa can go over the mountains, so yeah! Got a little fire moving free, man. <laughs> Fucking great map design. Anyway, I was thinking about uh, getting some new toys. Uh, I do believe I bought Marth an iron sword off screen. Um, I think I'll buy another one for him, actually. Yeah, sure. And then I'll actually buy something for the convoy. This Marth is the fucking convoy in this game. Uh, and I think I would like an iron lance. As well as a javelin. And another iron bow, maybe? Sounds good. Alright. Uh, I also think there's one... Um, I think there's one house I haven't visited. I did forgot to say uh, a few things about Malaysia. Or Mala Malaysia, I think. Yeah. Ma Ma Malaysia. Malaysia, right. That's her name. Uh, she can use the Hammer and Staff, as some of you pointed out in the comments. Um, which makes her kind of good. Also, I think I undervalued her a little bit. She is actually pretty darn decent, as far as the healer goes. Her stats are actually pretty good for a cleric in this game. Uh, also, as Mr. Antinan pointed out, Cecil is actually the superior of the three cavaliers, simply because her base stats are so much better than Roddy's. So, I don't think Cecil is going to be my main cavalier. Also, she can use Silverlands at base, which I think is pretty fucking fantastic. So, I'm actually going to trade over Alan's Silverlands. I think I'm still gonna keep a lance on him, but yeah, I, I think I still think I'm going to use Alan a little bit. However, giving Cecil a silver lance is, in my opinion, pretty fantastic because if I remember correctly, yeah, she has six. No, she has, actually has one attack speed with the silver lance, um, but she does like almost twice the damage though. But I, th I still think actually this. Oh crap! I, I still think the silver lance will probably be better. Yeah. Anyway, we got some thieves coming. Uh, we should probably deal with them. We could send Doga, but the problem with Doga is that um, Doga, he can't go over the mountain, so he's kind of useless in that regard. But I guess we could grind some experience off these thieves. Oh my god, Doga dodged the last one just for good measure. I also think I'm going to use Gordon over Ryan simply because Gordon's base stats are so much better. Uh, for that reason alone, I think I actually kind of want to trade. I think I want to train the Iron Bow over, because the Steel Bow is so heavy and inaccurate. In this situation, we don't really... Like, I get two attack speed with the Iron Bow. That's much better. And that's a level up for Gordon. Weapon level? He leveled weapon level, didn't he? Fuck! But yeah, I think I'm going to use Cecil here, but I think I'm going to switch over to the Silver Lance. Uh, sorry, the Slim Lance, because it's so fucking light. And also this bandit is on a mountain, so he's uh, oh, come on. Come on. Well, at least I have my healer nearby. She is actually pretty good, this healer. Da -da -da. I also turned- no, wait, I should have turned off her animations, that was what I was intending to do. But I guess we could watch her nice healing animation once first. Uh, I do believe we have a javelin. I guess we could throw a javelin at the guy. We won't kill him. We won't hit him either, so that's completely fine. I guess we could uh, use uh, Roddy to visit this house then. The deceased King Grunia had two children. Princess Yumina and Princess Yubello, twins of 13 to 40 years of age. The king was scarred of scarred actually. Scared of Garnef, so he sent the two to Kadain. I heard they were held as hostages and locked inside a dark room. When they were finally rescued by Wendell, they were on the brink of death. 
The bishop immediately took them to a monastery in Cadain to care for them. Yeah, you bell. I do believe that was joined later. All right, time to tackle the choke point of doom. All right, I keep these guys actually have hand axes. Boomerang axe to go. Now this is a fucking terrible map design. Why the fuck would you bottleneck your? <laughs> oh, it's terrible. Luckily, Cecil is good. However, she's gonna have to dismount in order to cross that mountain path. Oh, thanks. I I took vulnerary. Like, hey, give me that. All right. Uh, yeah, Mart needs to make his way back to the rest of the team. Luckily, he's pretty quick. Uh, let's see. So Cecil should probably be healed up. I'm just going to config the animation away. That way, I can heal like this, which is much better. So yeah, I need to dismount. I can't move after dismounting, sadly. Um, I don't think Gordon can do it. He can't cross here anyway, so it doesn't really matter much. I guess I could just shoot some iron bows at this thief. Come on! Don't dodge. Yeah, I'm pretty sure Doga cannot move in mountains. Maybe I should send Alan up. I could dismount him as well, I suppose. This game is stupid. And sometimes the map design of Fire Emblem 3 really baffles me. I wonder what the hell they were thinking. But, ah! Come on. Yeah, the thieves aren't attacking you either in this game. They, they just aren't. Alright. Oh, crap. I didn't mean to press wait there. I guess it's too late to do anything about that. Oh, well. I guess at least I'm in the mountain. And I think Cecil attacks twice with the Iron Sword. Wow, 11% chance to hit. Yeah, Cecil! MVP! Oh, Marth is coming. Let's see, maybe I'll send Alan after her? Sounds like a solid plan. I guess I could use Gordon to attack the bandit on the forge. And uh, Doga can grind some experience off the thieves. Doga, slay little puny thief. Come here. Doga, I'll teach you what happens to thief who steal from village. Yes. Blood on armor. Makes Doga pretty boy. I must be so fucking frustrating for a thief. No matter how well he aims, he will never do damage. Alright, the fucker's on a forge. Of course. And he's attacking Alan. That's fine. Even when dismounted, Alan is still way better than anyone on this team. Yeah, hooray for choke points! Ow, I need to heal Cecil now, actually. I could use a vulnerary. Hmm. Like, I, I, if I manage to kill this thief, which I don't think I will... Let's see, I need three attack speed or more to double this guy. He has 15 hit points. Can I actually... No, this won't kill him, suddenly. But it might do some damage to him. I could have critted, but no. So, do I just use a vulnerary here? Uh, she has 10 hit points left. I think I will. Yeah, I think I will. It's not like vulnerarys are that rare. Next turn, Marth can enter the fray, so we're all good. Dun, 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 dun. But yeah, you can actually heal people on this game without them needing to be on full health, or damaged, I should say. So theoretically, you could level up your clerics really fucking quickly. If you just have enough heal staffs, you could just stand and heal people to death, pretty much. And uh, you'll be level 20 in no time. Similar to how I leveled up my healers in Fire Emblem 1 by just letting them get hits on a forge. Another thief? Are you fucking kidding me? Wow, this map design. Whoa. So exciting. Oh, I can't wait to reach General Lawrence. Well, thieves haven't learned their lesson yet. Alright, so this guy has fucker has 7 hit points left, so I should be able. Uh, seven hit points, four defense, and Iron Bow should do it. If my math is correct, which is, it's not always correct. Never mind, Gordon crits, doesn't need math. Just because Gordon's awesome. And then I think I will actually mount on the porch. Um, 18 hit points, I think I'll kill him. 
Uh, yeah, no, he'll have like one hit point left, two hit points left to be precise. Ha! Save that one. Skill, speed, luck, weapon level. Awesome. It's a good first level, actually. Oh, what's going on here? It seems the Empire's reinforcements have come. It's already reached a stage. Lord, o oh, it's Ogma. Lord Ogma, I am deeply sorry for getting you involved in all of this. But could you listen to one last request of mine? I was sent here by King Talus to help you. If there is anything I can do for you, please ask. Uh, I see that so. Well, then I ask of you. Please send these children to Macedonia. These children, Princess Eubelo and Princess Yumina, are the children of the late King Runia. I have always been protecting them in secret, but that is no longer possible. If they fell into General Lang's hands, I bet he would execute them. Without question. Please, take these children to Wendell at Macedonia. I understand. I will protect these two with my life. Truly? Thank you. Well, Prince Yubello, Princess Yumina, you will escape with Lord Ogma. No, I won't go. If we must escape, Lawrence must come with us too. Princess Yumina, I'm afraid I cannot leave. My body is in such agony that even walking pains me. So please don't worry about me. You two must flee. Why? Why must you say that? Lawrence, you fought to protect us. That's why you suffered such a heavy wound. How can you tell us to leave you? I will not go. I will not leave your side. What should we do, General? Hmm, this is troublesome. Yumina will undoubtedly stick to her word. I apologize, Lord Ogma. You may leave. I understand. Then I will find another way to help you. I will free find Lang and kill him. I will use my blade to send him to his grave. Ha <laughs> ha, you fucked, Lang. You fucked. You angered Ogma. If I succeed, perhaps the nearby enemies will retreat. General Lawrence, you must live to see that day. Don't get yourself killed. Alright. Um, uh, cool. Wait, have I visited the house to the to the left? I actually can't remember if I did that. Uh, oh, here they come. Yay, choke points. Woo! Perhaps I should have given... Oh, crap. That guy actually hit Cecil very reliably. Oh. Well, from her position right now, only one of the archers can actually hit her, which is nice. And she gets healing, so we're all good. Can I walk into the mountains with my healer? I don't think so. I know Gordon can't, so I'll just send him down here to kill thieves, I guess. However, I know Marth can reach the mountains, because Marth, Marth is pretty fucking fast. We all know Marth likes to go fast. Uh, what was I going to say? Uh, blah, 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 blah. I can't remember. Yeah, the house. I was going to visit the house. So I can go do that with Doga. Doga will uh, break down. No, Doga, don't! Doga attack people inside house. After the previous war ended, Princess Nina handed over this country to General Lawrence and allowed him to friendly free rule. Friendly rule, actually. However, after Harden became emperor, he removed General Lawrence's power and sent Lang's army here. Lang stole everything from us. Not just money, but also food, clothes, and even our loved ones were... Oh, if only General Camus was still here, then you wouldn't need to fear Lang. Sadly, Camus will uh, appear later in the form of Sirius, so you're all good. Spoilers! Sorry. Alright, I'll try to send... Uh, I can never pronounce... Malay... Malay... I can never fucking pronounce this trick name. Malaysia. Over the mountain, I suppose. I don't think I need to send everyone, do I? Nah, we're good. Oh, Jesus Christ, this map is so slow just because of that one freaking mountain everyone has to get over. And, uh, double, 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 double. God, true hits! You have spoiled me. If you don't know what true hit is, it's essentially in the Game Boy Advanced games. Uh, the RNG is much is actually lying. Here in these games, the RNG is very true to its words. 72% is actually 72%. Whereas in Fire Emblem 6, 7, and 8, 72% uh, is more like 76%. So you get a little bit fooled by the false hit rates. Alright, let's see if uh, Cecil can kill this guy. Uh, 15 hit points, should be able to. Maybe I'll just use the Silver Lance. Yeah, I'll just one-shot the guy with the Silver Lance. Much, much easier. Or can I? Yeah, I can. Antonin was the one who pointed out that Cecil could use Silver Lance's base, which is actually pretty cool. You really don't need a lot of weapon level. I most most of the good weapons cap out at around 10, and I think the legendary ones require 12 or 13. So weapon level is a very redundant stat. If you just have a little bit of growth in it, then everyone should really be fine. 
Uh, let's see, the rapier actually has the same might as the iron sword, so there's very little reason not to use the rapier. You can buy more rapiers too, they're not- Oh, and it got critical. So that's something. I really want to be a little bit careful and don't feed Marth too much. Yeah, she can't cross the mountains. Fuck you, game. Uh, I guess these guys can clean up the remaining guys. While we, uh, attack the thieves. Thanks for the experience, I suppose. Dog a wheel stump on puny thief. I don't really know what they're going for, though. I've already saved the village. Or can they still destroy the village? Where are they going? Are they just retreating off the map? Alright, level up for Doga. Luck and weapon level. Well, that's... that's Doga. Well, his luck kind of sucks, so I actually kind of like the fact that it levels up. So if you don't know what luck does in this game, it pretty much gives you a void and critical avoid, and that's it. It doesn't give you hits, it just gives you... But critical avoid is a pretty darn handy stat to have. Because you don't want to get critical by enemies. Arth actually got 8 in critical, which is pretty darn decent. Actually, I think I want to give a javelin to Cecil, come to think of it. Yeah, we can't heal this damage up, so... Come on, thieves, what are you hoping to accomplish? They just want to get out of the cave! Uh, let's see, who has the javelin? I think it's Luke. Yeah, so I can trade the javelin. Yeah. Trade! That way, she can help out as well. Uh, I'm not sure if it helps. Well, the guy is actually going to die if I hit him. So that's good. Cecil, good units. Skill, luck, weapon level, and a vulnerary. Awesome. That's, uh, Cecil's leveling up pretty decently. If only she could get some strength now. Um, not sure if I actually want to leave this mountain spot. In fact, I think I'm going to use a vulnerary just in case the shit hits the fan. Da -da -da -da. Killing more thieves! Because we cannot cross mountains. Yay! I guess that's why these thieves are spawning. They are literally just spawning to give the other guy something to do. Maybe they were aware of their own fatal flaw. Doga has, for your information, not taken damage. He just leveled up. That's the only thing that can injure Doga. <laughs> Level ups. <laughs> Doga not hurt. Doga just comes stronger, so he needs healing to catch up with his awesome self. Also, not sure why Doga is Russian, but I blame Ray. Alright. I hope there's no reinforcements. I don't think there's any reinforcements. God damn it, why is this archer so accurate? I'm in a freaking mountain. Well, I guess bows are very accurate in this game. And mountains don't, like, terrain don't give you extra defense. The only thing terrain does is gives you avoidance, and I do believe the, the mountain gives you 25%. Awesome! Ba -ba 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 -ba. Alright, now I think- I have fuck 11 fucking hit points, I don't want to risk it. This song is awesome. God, this song is so amazing. Look, it's in front of a house. That's some cool animation right there, or some cool graphics. Alright. We don't got any ma many enemies left. I can't even remember if we're gonna fight Lawrence or not. I think you just talk to him. I can't remember actually killing him in this game. It's been so many years since I played it. Ba -da -ba -da. Okay, come on now. Die! No, not Marth. Don't die, Marth, please. Well, Lawrence is wielding a broken lance, so he's not gonna be able to do anything to me. Oh, I am pretty sure Cecil. Oh crap, there's a mountain here. No! Oh, there's a mountain here as well. Why do you torment me so game? Doga crushed thief. I think this is the last thief. I should have just killed that archer with Marth. Fucking hell. Oh, come on! Well, did it, did it actually say Doga parried? Is dodge and parry different things in this game? Ba-ba-ba-ba-ba-ba-ba-ba-ba-ba-ba-ba-ba-ba-ba-ba-ba-ba-ba-ba-ba-ba-ba-ba-ba-ba-ba-ba-ba-ba-ba-ba-ba-
Strength and speed? That's a perfect level up. That's two of the most valuable stats right there. So that's uh, freaking amazing for Gordon. Okay, so they 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 just don't move at all. Okay. All right, let's mount and silver lance. Nah, we'll use slim lance. Silver lance is expensive. We don't want to waste it. Yep. Yeah. yeah. Oh, come on. All right, I want to visit this house before. I'm sure if. Yeah, you can talk to him. You can also attack him though. Uh... 11 damage, that's not a lot. But I think I want to visit this house first, I can't remember, but I do want to visit every house. I do want to get all the story elements. I only saw a glance of him, but that paladin, Alan, didn't look too good. In any case, if he continues fighting, it will be difficult for others to improve. Oh, so that's... Did you just backtalk, Alan? What a rude old lady you are. Okay, so this guy isn't even moving anymore, okay. <laughs> Fine. We'll just kill you then. Oh, come on! I don't think there's any more thieves to kill. So let's go talk to Lawrence, I suppose. Lord Moth, it's you! Although I knew the enemy's reinforcements had come, but I didn't expect it was you. It is a shame that we must fight a Risha. And fight against your highness. Please wait. I don't intend to fight with you. From the citizens, I have discovered disturbing facts about the atrocities performed by the occupation army. I will inform Emperor Harden about these facts. If I meet him, I will definitely be able to rescue Grunia. So please, put away your weapon. Oh, his weapon is broken, Marth. I don't think it's going to pose much of a threat to you. Your highness, I appreciate your favor. But that is impossible. Your highness, you don't know a thing of you. You think that someone like Hardin would set a heartless man like Lang here for no reason? He wanted to provoke us into rebelling so that the kingdom of Grunia would be completely destroyed and become ruled by the Empire. That is the reason why he sent such a cold-blooded man here. What? But I, I, I couldn't possibly believe Hardin could do such a thing. I didn't expect you to accept the truth so quickly. However, since he became Emperor, he has completely changed. He is no longer the Hardin yet your highness once knew. Anyway, I believe we're finished here. However, your highness, I have just one last request. In this fortress, Grunia's royal princes and, pri princes and prince are hiding. Please, save those children. If you can promise me that, I will have no regrets. Lord Marth, let's just say that, in exchange for my life, these children, I will hand them in your care. What? <laughs> Did he just blow himself up? You said there are children inside the castle and you blow the fucking castle up? What? General Lawrence, how could you? The children! What? Oh, we actually get another turn. Okay. Okay, so he just committed suicide for- Oh. What? What? Oh, he's, he wants to move to the throne to protect it. Ah, the yeah, AI does that. Oh, at least Cecil gets a chance to kill him, though. What? Why the fuck did General Lawrence commit suicide? That, that just doesn't make any sense. Oh. You two are Grunius Prince... Oh, right! I thought Ogma took them with him, but I guess he didn't. You two are Grunius Prince Yubello and Princess Yumina? Wow, Lawrence, he's dead! What should we do? You fiends, don't come near us, otherwise... We'll kill ourselves! What the fuck is up with suicide in this game? Well, it was made in Japan, but um, psh, oh, that was a terrible one, thanks. No, you got it wrong! Oh. Oh, ha, huh, it's that fucker again. Ah, Lord Bath, you finally caught the rebels! Good General Lang, wait, those children are innocent. Can you hand them to us? That is impossible. Prisoners of war must be taken to my castle. I must also execute them as soon as possible, so that other people dare not defy us. Ah, your highness, you must head immediately to Macedonia. The Macedonian army has rebelled, and his princes appear to have been captured by them. Emperor Hardin has ordered that you would go and rescue Princess Minerva. What? Macedonia? I understand, General. If it's to rescue Princess Minerva, I will gladly go. But please hand those children to me. I beg of you, General Lang. Don't be stubborn, your highness. When I said no, I meant it. Well, you two, come over here. 
No, let go of me! You better help me! Yumina! Yumina! Wait, wait! Lang! Release those children! Your Highness, please calm down. If you fight Lang now, we will become traitors. On top of that, we currently don't have the strength to oppose, oppose Lang's army. But Jagan, can we really give those children to Lang? But I... Right now, no matter what, we must stay calm. If we go to Macedonia and successfully rescue Prince Minerva, Macedonia may be able to help us. Your Highness, please stay calm. For now, we must first go to Macedonia. Oh my god, it's that music again! Okay, I'm done. Sorry. All right, ladies and gentlemen, hope you guys enjoyed the second part of Let's Play Fire Emblem 3. I will be back pretty soon. You can count on that. So if you enjoyed this episode, please consider giving it a like and a comment. It really helps out. As always, guys, I'll see you next time. Oh my god, it, 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 it changes! Oh my god, it's so... Okay, never mind, goodbye.